Let's go deep into space like you have never seen it before. Astronomers using a brand new telescope to capture amazing 3D images of an exploding star. A supernova, in fact. Wow. Michio Kaku, theoretical physics professor, host of the Science Channel series Sci-Fi Science Physics of the Impossible. By the way, season number two starts September 1st. How are you doing, Michio? Very good. Good morning to you. Put that picture back up. That was amazing. It looked like an hourglass or That's something. That's right. This is spectacular. The greatest explosion in the universe. What Second only to What's the Big Bang. On? We have here a star maybe 10, 20 times more massive than our sun that blew its top, literally blew its smell south to smithereens. And scientists are now getting three-dimensional recreations, second by second, of the explosion itself. This is incredible work. Wow. Uh, it's the first time we've seen them. So somebody like you can sit here in New York and look at this picture and see what? In there. <laughs> well, we because see. I think it just looks beautiful. It's beautiful. But I'm certain that it has a lot more significance to folks like you. That's right. We were clueless as to about how stars die. And it's very important. Our sun will not explode like a supernova. But if a nearby star blows up, it could literally destroy all life on Earth. So we have to know the life cycle of stars, including how they die. And they, just, they die with the biggest fireworks mm. known to science other than the Big Bang. And we're able to do this with 3D now, which gives you more depth and more perception. And it's the first time, second by second. So I'm thinking a guy like you, you can't wait to see these photos. That's right. I mean, I went to the internet immediately and said, oh my God, second by second creation of how a star, first of all, uses up its nuclear mass, collapses, and then bounces back in one of the greatest cataclysms that we can measure, it, out, it outshines a hundred billion stars. Uh, and it's violent, I'd imagine. It's very violent, Especially but it also core. creates higher elements out of which we are made. Our bodies actually came out of a supernova that blew up even before our sun was born. How about that? Understanding supernova is very critical because it, it takes us back to the beginning of our planet's time, and it may also forecast into the future. That's Tell right. me why it's important. It's important because first, we are made out of stardust. Every atom in our body was baked inside a star someplace. We're literally made out of stardust. Second of all, they're potentially dangerous. If a nearby supernova blows up, we have to have warning. We have to know if it's going to happen or not. And it really tells us our origins. It tells us where we came from. They were part of a larger cosmic cycle of the universe itself. That's, and that's what created planet Earth. That's right. That's where we come from. We come from a supernova. That's awesome stuff. What are you going to do with this, Michio? Well, we hope to then project into the future uh, how the evolution of the Earth will go, I mean, of, of the universe will yeah. progress in the future, and how it all began with a giant, even a bigger explosion called the Big Bang. And then maybe ultimately one day we go that way. Let's hope not, huh? <laughs> Nine o'clock on the Science Channel. Congratulations on your second series. Well done. Yeah. I know you're really pumped up for that, so. That's right. September 1st. Right. We'll check it out. 9 for this guy. Pat again, what's